It's part two of the Capital One Cup semi-final. We're here at the magnificent Etihad Stadium for the second leg. I'm joined by Ronnie Goodless, who knows what it's like to play and win a League Cup semi-final with Everton. What's your gut feeling, Ronnie? I think we'll beat them tonight, son. And I just think Sunday it was really disappointing, and I just think the lads will prove it. We proved a couple of weeks back that we can, uh, you know, we can match Man City. And I think the, you know, the nil nil that we got here was was extremely good because you, you know you look at the record they've got at the Etihad is, is second to, to anybody. But I think Aguero's the man we've got to watch. But I, I just think a lot of the lads for me will, will want to prove that you know you know we're better than we are on Sunday, and it's not just the the Sunday game. I just think you know the last few games we've sort of you know gone out there, we've we've performed to a certain standard, but you know, we've hit some fantastic levels this season. I mean, really done well. You know, we've beat Man City at our place. And I just think tonight is let's stand up and be counting. And I think the, the 8,000, 8,500, I think they'll be dotted everywhere Everton is tonight. But uh, I think the vocal support off them will play a big part. But it was similar when we, we played Bolton. You know, we, you go away, Bolton scored late on uh, at Goodison. Uh, we drew and obviously had to go to Bolton. We beat them 1 0. And I think with, with support and everyone pulling together, I've, I put a message on Twitter today about everyone pulled together tonight. And I just think it'll come together management, players, supporters. And, and I just think tonight, as one, you, you, you know, we, we can go out there and perform. And I, I do really think, I'm not saying we'll go out there and win 2 or 3 0, but I think it'll be difficult. But I, but I really do think we can get the result that we need. What's the mindset of Everton tonight, Ronnie? We're 2 1 up, we're halfway through the two legged tie. Do we stick or twist? I think we've got to go for it, Dan. I, I really do. I think with Lukaku, Delafeu. I mean, Delafeu second half for me on Sunday threw four wheel cross crosses in, and I just think tonight do do the same again. If he can get some crosses in, and I think Lukaku or whatever is there, Ross Barkley can get on the end of it. But I, I think we just sit back and admire Man City, and you know, quieten the crown for the first 25 minutes, or let's get to half time on level terms. You know, they, they've still got to score one. And I just think tonight, if we can get that first goal, I really do think we can kick on. But, uh, you know, I don't want to see us sit back. I think we've got players in the team that they'll be very, very wary of, you know. You've sort of got, you know, Jim Michaelis and all these. We don't know Man City's team yet. But we, we, we've shown in the last couple of uh, games against them that, that we can score goals against them. We do worry them. We have got the pace. We have got the strength. And I just think here tonight, what a setting for, for lads to, to end up as legends. I mean, you know, you know, they're fantastic. But, you know, you can start reading about it in 25 years or, or whatever, if we're still here. But uh, <laughs> it, it's something that, that does, you know, it's an occasion where you think, up against it, we, we can go there, go out there, let's perform. And I hope we're all smiling, obviously, at the end of the game. But I just think it's, it's an occasion tonight where, you know, stand up and be counted and we can get that result and get to Wembley. 1977, we played the first leg semi-final at home. 1984, we played the first leg semi-final at home. We've done so again in 2016. Will it be a third League Cup final for Everton? We shall see. We kick off at 7.45. Our referee is Martin Atkinson.